Now at any age, especially being a teenager, it's important to chase your dreams, but to also have a backup plan in case things go wrong. Midland Legacy's Chase Shores is no different. I'm willing to bet, however, his options are a little bit cooler than the ones you or I had at age 17. He's just a special kid and a special talent. It's no stretch to say Midland Legacy's Chase Shores is one of the top high school pitching prospects in the entire country. The six foot eight right-hander is ranked among the top 100 draft prospects by almost every major baseball publication. Needless to say, stepping in the batter's box and seeing Shores staring down at you has not been a welcome sight for high school hitters. It's pretty intimidating. Like, I mean, he gets down the mound, and you know, by the time he releases it, it's like right there in the mid. Shores is fastball is clocked consistently in the mid to high 90s with devastating breaking pitches. His arsenal and his build have scouts drooling over his potential. But to his teammates and friends who have known him for a decade or more, he's just one of the guys. I don't really see him different. He's just, he's my brother. Like, we're best friends and I just see him like as that guy. I don't really see him as the other guy. The other stuff's like really cool, but he'll always be my brother at heart no matter what. And the 17-year-old is facing a decision millions of teenagers will have to face upon graduation, going to college, or in his case, joining one of the nation's top college baseball programs at LSU, or joining the workforce. And for Shores, that could mean hearing his name called early in June's MLB draft, a new home this summer, and a couple million dollars in his bank account. It's a conundrum driven by his golden right arm, but it's one that weighs heavy on his mind. I think about it every day. It, I, wouldn't, it's, I wouldn't say it's all I think about, but it, it, it does come across my mind a lot. Um, you know, every day I work, I work towards that goal, and you know, I, I trust in my preparation. I trust in the work that I put in uh, to hopefully, hopefully make that dream come true. Whether it's you know the, the route to LSU, or if he's fortunate enough to get drafted, um, you know, it, it's a blessing, and and neither road is, is a bad choice. You ready? Are you ready is a question best saved for Chase himself. I'm just having fun with it right now. Um, yeah, playing with my teammates that I've been growing up with my whole life. I just, I think that's very special. And, you know, after this year, I probably won't get to do that. For the people around him, the answer is even more simple. They know he's ready. His work is where he has gotten him to where he is now. And, uh, you know, even if he stumbles, he's going to continue to work and get through it. I really think he's got a shot to be a, be a special one up there. I think Chase will be a dominant major league pitcher. And as all athletes know, we're all told at some point in time we can no longer play the children's game. Chase isn't ready for that just yet. Honestly, I just want to play baseball for as long as I can. Um, not many people get to play after high school. Not many people get to play after college. And you know, if, if I'm fortunate enough to play in the major leagues, then that will be a dream come true.